practice exercise 4 of time speed distance funda book let's go through the questions question 21 15 men or 24 women or 36 boys can do a work in 12 days working 8 hours a day how many men must be associated with 12 women and 6 boys to do another work 2.25 times as great in 30 days working 6 hours per day now since the question is asking us to find how many men we should look at converting everything in terms of number of men as for the question 15 men are equivalent to 24 women are equivalent to 36 boys in terms of the amount of work which they can do so which means let's uh, all of them are multiples of 3 so i can say 5 men can do as much work as 8 women who can do as much work as uh, 12 boys okay. so one boy i can say one boy is equivalent to 5 by 12 of men and one woman is equivalent to 8 by 12 or 2 by 3 of a man. So the, we can convert everything in terms of number of men using this relationship. The question says how many men, how many men, let's say the number of men is x, how many men must be associated with 12 women and 6 boys. To do another work which is 2.25 times as great. Okay, we will come to that part. So let us just see how many men does this mean. Now 12 boys are equivalent to 5 men. That means 6 boys should be equivalent to 2.5 men. So this is 2.5 men. Similarly, 8 women are equivalent to 5 men. So 12 women must be equivalent to 7.5 men. And we have x men out here. So the total number of men effectively is x plus 10. Okay. Where x is only x reflects to the, the little number of men and 10 reflects the equivalent of number of men for 20, uh, I'm sorry, for 12 women and 6 boys. Now as for the question, 15 men working 8 hours a day for 12 days can complete a piece of work so the question now becomes that if there are x plus 10 men working, what is the value of x? There are x plus 10 men working and they have to finish a work which is 2.14 times as great. 2.14 by 4 times, sorry 2.25 times or 2.145 is 9 by 4. So the amount of work has become 9 by 4 times. And they will be working for 30 days. At the rate of 6 hours per day. So we can say by applying chain rule that x plus 10 should be equal to originally there were 15 men. The number of hours per day have reduced. So the number of people should increase. So into 8 by 6. The number of days has gone up from 12 to 30. So number of days, so that means the number of men should reduce so into 12 by 30 and the amount of work earlier was 1 now it is 9 by 4 that means the number amount of work has increased so the number of men should also increase so into 9 by 4 which implies which would imply that x plus 10 is equal to 15 i'll just write it down here and then we can cancel out into 8 by 6 into 12 by 30 into 9 by 4 so 4 1s are 4, 4 2s are 8, 6 2s are 12, uh, 5 3s are 15, or rather 15 1s are 15 and 15 2s are 30, 2 2. So 9 into 2, 18. So x plus 10 is equal to 18 is what we have calculated. Or in other words, x should be equal to 8 or the number of men extra required is equal to 8. Now, if in this question you had not taken x to be in the number of men only, but you had taken x to be all of them, then you could have marked the answer none of these, which is choice E. Okay? Because then you would be looking for 18, which is why you should always 
take x as the variable which you need to actually find. In this question, we need to find the number of men. So we took x to be number of men only. Thank you.